Hello everyone and welcome. So we have completed our generative design assembly and it's looking great. So in this video we are going to add the text. So this tutorial is about the text. So let's start. Uh, so now we are going to add the text in this. Okay. So first I will be hiding the joints in it. So I'm just hiding them. But from here you can hide anything from here. As you all know. Now I'm going to add the text in it. So I'm going to the left view, the top and somewhat zooming it and now just go to the origin, show origin and I'm going to create sketch and click here. Okay, it's showing for the capture position, go and hit capture position. Great, now I'm going to add text, go to create and use text. If you open a dialog box. Okay, just clicking it where we want to add the text. I'm going to add first here. So I'm going to add a text software software garage. Drag it. I'm going to place it here. So more in the middle. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, you can change the font type of the font you want to use from here okay i'm going there's a default one you can change to bold italic underline so i'm going to use bold only bold you can also rotate your text the way you want i'm setting it for zero now and also you can adjust the height so let's take height about 15 okay and i'm just going to replace it from here to here okay so then I hit okay and hit on finish sketch and now we are going to extrude it so as you can see it's away from it and we are going to emboss this thing on this shaft so go to create or hit e for extrude and this will show this command just select this the thing you want to extrude and if you see this that if you hit it's going to extrude like this and we have to emboss it here so just click on the start engine and from from object so we have clicked it and just we have to select an object so i'm selecting this as an object as you can see it has been selected here and it has been printed out here and now i'm going to extrude it so just extrude outwards okay as you can see it has been embossed on just adjust the thing i think i should make it about minus two okay it's looking great and click on join i'm going to join it with the shaft only okay so as you think it has been done click on okay okay and it so as you can see it is done software garage it's looking great okay so are we done with this assembly if you want to know more about generative designing uh, you can see my blog or you can also visit my channel for some generative design tutorials and other things. Okay. So if we like the video, if you like the tutorials, then hit the like button for any queries, you can hit the comment box and don't forget to subscribe my channel till then keep learning, keep exploring.